Greetings everyone, this is Seth, the owner of Zero's channel, and today we're playing Burnout, the very first one. Not Burnout Paradise or Burnout Revenge or whatever, this is the one that started it all. And we're playing the GameCube version because it's the only one that I can seem to emulate. Oh, that's thunder. Yeah, I'm hearing thunder. Anyway, we're gonna play head-to-head, -head, and we have a few different cars to choose from, but they're, they're not even specific licensed cars, it just has simple names. There's Pickup, Super Mini, Sports Coupe, Saloon, and Muscle. I want the Saloon. I'm going with the... Um, saloon. I like the Sports Coupe, but I'm going to go with the Muscle Car, even though it doesn't look anything like a Muscle Car. I want the Red Saloon. I'm going with a Red Muscle Car. Saloon. Okay, I'm not sure what the controls are, so I'll, we'll just have to figure it out. Wait, wait. Go to Automatic. Yeah, I'm trying to... Okay, I was using the D-pad, that's fine. Okay, let's race on interstate. Number of AL racers? Eh, just one. Difficulty? Eh, easy. Let's go easy. Okay, just gotta press OK. Um, I'll try to confirm. Yeah. Oh, the X button's the accelerate button. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> vroom, vroom, and all that stuff. Get out of my way. Cars. There's a blue pickup truck in front of me. I'm not gonna let it win, cause not gonna let it win the race. I'm just gonna shoot it in the face. <laughs> it plays all very. It's pretty much like a standard arcade racer. In fact, this probably could have worked as an actual arcade game, because you know there's checkpoints and timers. Like checkpoints. <laughs> checkpoint. I was actually referencing Cruisin' World when I said that. So yeah. Because that's the most, um, that's the one arcade Ooh. racer I'm most familiar with. And, oh wow, like, this car's pretty slippery. It's a muscle car. Yeah, you're driving a sports coupe, I think. Or is that a saline? I can't it's remember. Saloon. Saloon, okay. <laughs> and I crashed. Yeah. No oh, good. there we go. You crashed too. Oh, we crashed into each other. I mean, not, not actually, but our corpses touched. Yeah, honestly, guys, my biggest problem with the Burnout series is basically the same problem I have with the newer Need for Speed games. Um, if you crash, you have to wait for the crash animation to finish before trying to accelerate and all that yeah, again. it's just, like, crash porn. Like, I kind of wish I could just reset and, um, like, I wish I had a manual reset. Like, some of the older Need for Speed games, a lot of people would call the newer Speed <laughs> Oh, you crashed. You crashed. Here you go, way too fast. Don't slow down, you gotta crash. <laughs> That's actually a song used in one of the Burnout games, by the way. <laughs> well, it certainly fits, considering the name. <laughs> I think the best Burnout game by far is the third one. No, I've it's... never played the third one, but I heard it was very good. You want to, it is. My favorite Burnout game is actually Burnout Paradise, mainly because it's the only one I actually own. I had a bad sense of direction, so that one kind of was lost on me. Because of how open world it was. I also heard good things about Burnout Revenge. Uh, yeah, most people don't like that one, but I had a lot of fun with it. Yeah, I actually played Revenge, and I remember liking it. Uh, I actually do like, um, I think the cars control pretty well in this game, though. Yeah, they're pretty tight. Yeah. It's definitely a game that any 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 person can pick up and play. Where are you? Oh, goodness. Apparently, I'm already on the second lap. Yeah, the the, tr the races in this game can actually be pretty long, so we'll probably be doing only one, maybe two races for this oh. Speedway Saturday. Speedway Saturday, literally. Yeah. Um, it's wrong Speedway. Whoa, whoa. Ah. I crashed into a taxi. It's that is one crazy taxi. I'm, sorry. I, I'm pretty sure it was a very calm taxi. I'm pretty sure you were the crazy one. <laughs> crazy person who crashed in your taxi. <laughs> I'm fine. Ten and twenty ten. <laughs> oh, I bumped again. Yeah, is this burnout or bumper cars? Oh, it's a lot more violent than bumper cars. Can you imagine if bumper cars had like slow mo crash montages? Like, <gasps> oh. Ah. I think actually that would be really, really boring <laughs> to watch. Yeah. No, Bumper cars that. with slow mo. Yeah. Boom. Oh, what? I just clipped that guy. Yeah, I, I really hate it when 
Like, this even happens in the new Need for Speed games. I really ha hate it when um, I just happen to, like, barely clip someone, and it's enough to send my car flying and spinning out. It really ticks me off. Ah, dang it, man. Yeah. Well, honestly, the new Need for Speed's just not very good. I actually like the newer Need for Speed games, especially the newest one for PS4. I haven't played that one. That one's actually uh, pretty good. Um, like, the newest um, Need for Speed game, they actually bring back some of the songs from the classic Need for Speed games, which is just a joy to my hearts because Aquila 303 is clearly the best song in the entire series. Yeah, in my it's opinion. just a joy to my heart, precious little heart. It's not like Gideon from Gravity Falls. Uh, I haven't seen that show in months. It's a pretty good show. I, I've heard good things about it. I have seen, like, maybe... Oh, come on! What? Look, my car isn't even damaged. Holy, holy crap, you're right. Ooh, I'm drifting. I'm so pro strats. Uh, what's the, the drift button? Uh, I think the, car the cars drift automatically. Well, my car seems to drift automatically. I mean, I guess the controls are so tight, there really doesn't need to be a drift button. Yeah. In later games, though, are. It's really satisfying to drift. I love games where you drift. Same here. Like, the first racing game I've ever played that had drifting, besides Mario Kart, is um, uh, OutRun 2006, a uh, game by Sega. It's, it's actually one of my favorite franchises by Sega, and I really wish they'd make a new one, even if they replaced Ferraris with Lamborghinis. I just want to do Okay, that was a crush. <laughs> I'll tell you guys I'm bad. Checkpoint! Um, that's why I got such a kick out of the Sonic and Sega All Stars racing games is because oh, oh, yeah. it's all dependent on drifting and it's like oh, yeah. skill based drifting. Yeah, I really like it. Yeah, I especially love the drifting in All Stars Racing Transformed because it feels more like actual drifting, while the original Sega All Stars Racing was more Mario Kart like drifting. Yeah, well, I don't Mario Kart drifting. It, it's not. I mean, I haven't played eight very much, so maybe that drifting's a little better. But I don't yeah, know. Mario Kart eight is my favorite of the Mario Kart series. I think I played eight once. And I was here. Yeah. So. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna come get you. If you can see me. I have no idea where you are, but I'm gonna get you. Oh crap! I forgot we have a we have a boost ability. But apparently, in order to use boost, you have to uh, have this meter fill up. I forgot this thing out of boost feature. I, apparently, in order to fill up the boost meter feature, you have to do dangerous driving, like near misses and. Yeah. So now I can finally use my boost ah, by, by holding right trigger. So fast. Oh my god, I'm so fast. I think I'm, I'm going to have to wait until I get to the menu to actually catch up to you. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> Probably right next to you, man. Or, or, maybe, you'll run out, or, or you'll may, maybe you'll run out of time before that happens. I'll run out of time before I'm on the menu? No, before, I, before you cross the finish line. Oh. Either way, I'll be, once we get to the menu, I'll be right next to you. Ah. That, that's, that's the joke. Hmm. You know, another, there's actually another series of racing games I like to try at a later point, which would probably be the Ridge Racer series, but I'll probably hmm. handle those later. Yeah. I don't think I'll stick around for that one. Yeah. I'd rather have um, Will experience Ridge Racer, because when he's actually trying to get into, more, into some of these types of racing games, but he wants the control to be more arcade-like, and I think um, Ridge Racer and Need for Speed this, are my... This isn't arcade-like? Okay, this is arcade-like, so yeah, a Burnout could work for him, oh. too, but um, but I think something tells me he would find Burnout to be kind of boring. Well, this one, anyway. Yeah, this one isn't. I'm sure he would like Revenge and... Uh, or not Revenge, uh, Paradise more. Well, Revenge is a lot more fun than Paradise. Like I said, I couldn't... I don't know, Paradise is... There's not really a good map for Paradise. It's like, all right, memorize all the roads, then go out, and which is really good for some people. But for me, like I don't even have a license. And oh, finish! Oh, we still beat the other guy. Yeah. Well, that, well, that, so that, so that race lasted for about eight minutes, uh, seven oh, in my case. So I think we have time for one more race. I don't know. I think we bored the audience to death. You sure? All right. Well, if you say so, we will end it here. So, so yeah, that was Burnout. I hope you all enjoyed our little look at this game. It's, as for what I think of the first Burnout game, it's 
It's playable. It's perfectly fine. It's not a bad game. It's just that it pales in comparison to the newer games, especially Paradise, in my opinion. But, um, uh, John, what do you think? Uh, I think it's fun. I used to have a PC. I, I got a kick out of it. Hmm. Yeah, I really... Like, from what you said, I really should play Burnout 3. I gotta play 3. It's it's a real good party game, because it has that crash mode. Oh yeah, isn't that... So that's the first game to introduce crash mode? Uh, I believe so. I don't know about the second one. I've never, never yeah. played the second one. Yeah, the first time I ever saw the crash mode in action was in Burnout Revenge, but you know, but I digress. It does it a lot better. The, the course designs for the crash mode are just not on perfect. I see. Alright, well, with that said, that was Burnout, and I'll see you all next time. Thank you all so much for watching, and take care. Yay!